Hi everybody, it's Stefan for cgtutspost.com and in this quick tip we are going to take a look at a another very cool free plugin for Cinema 4D which you can download from biomech.com website and go to the second page and open the free Cinema 4D plugin section and here you can see the select loop plugin and you can download it right here and choose the version that you're using I'm using 11.5 so I'm going to download this and show you how to install it and go to Cinema 4D here we are in Cinema 4D plugins folder with the downloaded zip file for the plugin and just extract here and now you can delete the zip file and we are ready to go to launch Cinema 4D and show you how to work with the plugin. We are in Cinema 4D, so first of all let's change the our view region to 16 by 9 and to show you how the plugin works just I'm going just to drop a sphere and as you can see um we have our plugin here but when we click it nothing happens and that's because the sphere is a primitive object and let's increase the radius a bit we need to convert that to editable object so hit this button right here or C which is the shortcut and now we need to go into a polygon selection mode and we need to select probably a polygon come to the plugin and select loop but nothing happens as you can see and if we select the other option again nothing will happen so what's wrong we need basically to select two polygons that are next to each other so two polygons come to plugin select loop and choose select loop and as you can see the plugin selects the whole loop of polygons so this might be pretty helpful for example if you want to extrude this part of the sphere and after that you can just bevel it or do something crazy to achieve some unique results probably a strange or abstract architecture things or stuff like that and this is pretty helpful let's undo that and let's go and see what the other option of the plugin does so again select two polygons come to plugins select loop and choose the second option which will ask us how many basically what this option does let me show you if we choose two and click ok it will select every second polygon and basically it's going to skip one polygon and this is useful for example if you you're creating something like a I don't know what type of thing but uh, sure you can extrude this or just bevel it and uh, create something abstract and um, it might be helpful in uh, various different situations so if we choose the same option and set this to 3 it will skip two polygons and again if we apply it and type 5 it will skip 5 polygons but as you can see we have only 1 2 3 4 here 4 here 4 here and 4 here and only 5 or four here well we don't have five polygons skipping
skipped because we don't have enough segments in the sphere to do that so that's the reason why we can't select every fifth polygon of the loop and basically if we select those two and select this and type one and click ok it's going to select a full loop again so that's how the select loop plugin works i think it's pretty helpful and i use it a lot when modeling because i'm not very good at modeling in cinema 4d so this plugin is a lifesaver for me and i hope it's going to help you too so go download the plugin it's free and don't forget that it only works with polygon objects so take that in mind and once again i'm stefan for cgtutsplus.com and we'll see you next time